Hello everybody, this is Ice, and welcome back to another video. Today, we're going to be looking at something pretty darn cool, but completely useless. So, what you see in front of you is a feat of one-high logic. Now, if you aren't sure how one-high logic with pistons works, I made a video on it a while ago. It showcased a few basic logic gates as well as, I think, some memory? I'm not sure. But anyway, I've taken these gates up to the next level in this circuit, and built a 2-bit binary decoder. Now, let's have a look at what this thing does. It takes two inputs and gives out four outputs. You can't really use them because they're in the middle of the device, but meh, it's okay. I have signs on them, so you can see which is which. So these two inputs are going to represent a binary number. So for instance, right now, 0, 0 is the binary number 0, and as you can see, that's what this decoder is saying. If we go ahead and flip on one of these levers, it's going to send pulses through all this machine, and we're going to see that it's changed to 1. Now we have the binary number 0, 1 on, and indeed that is 1, so, so far it has worked. And, well, next thing we should try is 2, so let's see what happens here. As you can see, it's gone through again, and hey, look at that! It's actually shown in two. Now the final test is to see if it works for the number three. So the number two is one zero in binary, as you can see, on, off. But if we want to show the number three, well, let's just try this. And lo and behold, it has worked. We've inputted the number one one using two on levers in binary, and we've come out with a 3. Now, I'm not saying this has any use. It's completely and utterly useless. There's absolutely nothing you could ever do with this, because just to start with, the outputs are in the middle of the device. Using one high logic, you could never even get them out. However, I've looked around different redstone communities for a while, and I haven't seen any one high logic beyond basic gates. So, this is probably setting some sort of record. I made it actually a long time ago, but it's pretty neat. I think it's pretty neat, just because it's crazy. It's doing so much weird stuff that I like it. So, that's about that. I don't think this thing needs a tutorial. If anybody's interested, then just say so down in the comments, and I'll put a download. But yeah, that's about it. So hopefully you enjoyed this pretty simple component showcase, and as always, well, bye now.